now I'm using the hand mixer to mix up that cream cheese, which is long softened. It's been way more than 45 minutes since I pulled the um, pumpkin roll out. So we got sidetracked making cider. So I'm gonna include some of those cider videos. So it whips up kind of like a frosting. And when it's looking pretty whippy, it's ready. All right, so this is my favorite part. We are going to open the pumpkin roll up. It's nice and cool. And spread the frosting on. So here goes. We'll just plop all the frosting in. It tastes really good. And then I like this kind of spreader to spread it all the way into the cracks. And that's all there is to it. You'll re-roll it up and you can garnish the top with a little more, um, of your powdered sugar to make it look pretty if you want to. I don't even mind because it tastes fine the way it is. Ta-da! And there's your finished pumpkin roll. So I hope you guys had a great time learning how to make pumpkin roll from fresh pumpkin, but you can use your fresh pumpkin for anything really. Pumpkin muffins, pumpkin pie, pumpkin smoothie, anything. Thanks!